Hello everybody and welcome back to the Dolly Cam. So this is gonna be one of our last feeds of the day. We have been so busy at this wonderful show with out here in Wilmington, Ohio, and we are here in the booth of Fritzy's Dolls. Fritzy always has such fabulous dolls and just does wonderful, wonderful vignettes. She is a doll shop owner on Ruby Lane. And when she gets home, she is gonna be listing so many of these great dolls on her site. This is a great little Gretchen. She's so cute. If you guys are here live with us, tell us where you are. Hello, Helen. This little walrus is just wonderful. Fritzy, I know you've been working hard, dear, so we're just kind of cruising through and you can say something if you want, but uh, the, your booth is just wonderful. Fritzy has been dressed um, in, a, in a witch hat today, which has been so, so fun. Hi, Fritzy. <laughs> you just look so cute. Doesn't she look cute? She looks adorable. She sure does. <laughs> She'll she'll cast a spell on you. She will. She'll cast a spell on <laughs> you. I like you it. Before you know it, you'll, she'll have your checkbook out and you'll be right there. <laughs> I love it. That is true. If you look too close, so we have wonderful again. Fritzy's doll. She always just does a fabulous job staging her dolls. They're always doing something. Your dolls are always doing they something. They work hard. They do. They work hard. This ladybug I'm obsessed with. I saw her at your show. That's at the not show a in ladybug. That's oh. a spider. Oh, it's a spider. You have to know your spiders from your ladybug. <laughs> okay, it doesn't have dots. Bites, <laughs> <one> doesn't. <laughs> okay, that's why I liked it so much because I thought it looked so unique. Yeah, it is. <laughs> it is. Okay, that spider is wonderful. Oh, that's hysterical. It's by Stife. It's, it's by Stife. Yeah, look at that. That's great. Fritzy also has a lot of wonderful little uh, rare, really, really rare little buckets and things that dolls can hold, little noisemakers. It's so fun to just have fun with your dolls and, and have them get dressed up for Halloween. The googly displays is... Aren't they great? Yeah, really cute Wonderful Dust Me. That Dust Me is just, she She's is just, just phenomenal. Adorable. She is so, so, so cute. Fritzy, have you been having fun here out with your doll people? Oh, we have had a lot of fun. Yes, yeah. you've been having a lot of fun. And, we and had bargain tables. People just love those bargain tables. They do. Taking bagfuls of the stuff out. What did you think we of? We sell good dolls too. Oh yes, you yes, and but bargain bargain hunting is so much fun. Oh, absolutely. What did you think of Andy Oren's talk last night? Oh, I loved his talk. It was amazing. He had so much information packed in there. And, mm -hmm. you know, there were a lot of dealers that had come to see it, too, because there's always something to learn, no matter how much any of us know. And right. All this is kind of a specialty thing, I think. Mm -hmm. And they really know a lot about it. They had excellent examples. So if you ever get a chance to see that slide presentation, it's amazing. I totally agree. They had 101 fresh photos that they made just for that presentation. Yeah, it was such it was, a treat to be there. It was really beautiful. What did you think of those praying dolls? Those, those, the, the dolls that the molded, the ones that were like on their knees. They and were my praying. favorite. They were, they were my favorite yes, too. They were my favorite. They were incredible. We were just chatting about Andy Oren's talk on French and Bisque pocket dolls, which is smaller dolls uh, from 12 inches and under that are all bisque and we saw some wonderful variations. Of course, right now we are here live in the booth of Fritzy Martinez and she has Fritzy's dolls on Ruby Lane. This doll, whoa, that is a big mama jama. I just love her. She's 42 inches. 42. And Rachel, we will be at the Jamboree next week. Oh, tell us about the Jamboree. The Jamboree is in Minnesota at the Crown Plaza and the information about that, the phone number, if you still want to get in, is on the inside box cover of Antique Doll Collector. Okay. I have the Halloween ad there for the October issue, and that has the phone number that you can call to possibly still get into that jamboree. We're giving a, a slide presentation, PowerPoint presentation, um, like what Andy just did, only it's on Jamo's. Oh, great. And we're really going to zero in on the differences in EJs at that. We have some beautiful pictures. My daughter, uh, who's a lawyer, she helped us put it all together because this is the first time we've actually ever done oh, a talk like this. How we've, wonderful, you know, for with, with the slide and the yeah. PowerPoint thing. So, Megan worked 13 hours herself on it with oh my gosh. a lot of hours of 
but Rick and I didn't. But Megan said, Mom, at my billable hours, that would have been over $5,000. <laughs> oh, aren't you so proud of so her? it's a very expensive PowerPoint presentation. Yes. Oh, I can't wait. I, I wish I could be there. And um, so that sounds really wonderful. And then the next day is the doll show. The Jamboree is Friday night and Saturday, and then the next day is the doll show. But it's a lot of fun. It definitely has UFDC uh, influence and backing with that. And it's just a really great time in, in Minnesota. Yes, so. it sounds great. And then you're off to Gaithersburg. No, the thing we do after that is King County Toy and Doll Show, which okay. is the last weekend of October. It's actually a Halloween weekend, so I'm gonna have to wear uh, the switch costume for a while. Oh, you look darling in it. So mm -hmm. we're, we're gonna do that the last weekend. And then the 18th, is it, of November is Toledo. Toledo, and, okay. And we will have bargain tables at that. And we'll be there, and then yeah. we do Gaithersburg. And then you do the, okay. So I skipped ahead. You got a lot. You yeah. got a lot going on. That's wonderful. <laughs> you can show up, Rachel. We would love you to be. I there. I would love to be there, and you know, I just might. If you guys are not friends with Fritzy, get on her Facebook page because she's always sharing the funnest and most beautiful pictures and videos. She is like next to me. You are a social media queen. You have oh, a following. Thank you, <laughs> thank you Rachel. <laughs> you do. Um, but here again, if you guys are just tuning in, we're here with Fritzy Martinez, and she and Rick are such hard workers. They have been working so hard this past weekend here at the Wilmington, Ohio Doll Show, and we are giving you a, a tour of her booth. So if you see something, you can absolutely have it. Just uh, email Fritzy, or or you can call her through her Ruby Lane shop, and she is happy to help. They ship. This walrus is fantastic. The what? Oh, oh my gosh. Now he's wonderful. Can we open the... Look at this warrior, everybody. How old do you think he is, Fritzy? Very early. He is wonderful. Um, a, a warrior... Um, exhibit came through Denver like they sh they brought all the warrior costumes for the actual warriors and it was just wow. it was phenomenal to see uh, this is this is wonderful and that is made out of go fun yes and then other parts of his body are wood like all the salt oh I love him that is a new addition Fritzy always finds the most fabulous things. And then of course that's the bargain table, which there's so many wonderful bargains in there. If you have always wanted to fix up your own doll or you are, you can do it yourself, then it's just so wonderful to be able to do this and, and get things for a bargain and turn them into something very special. Fritzy, thank you. Thank we hope you, you have a great rest of your show. And on the next couple shows, we'll be looking for those pictures on your Facebook. Thank you, hon. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.